Alex. My next guest is currently one of the hottest uh, people on the planet. They called Pop. Now she uh, she um, only not only did her debut album go in at number one, but a debut single as well in the US. Please welcome Christina Aguilera. <laughs> Welcome to, uh, to Britain and Thank welcome so to much. CD UK. My pleasure. Um, only 18 and already have been compared as the, or, or, or tagged as the new uh, Mariah Carey. How does uh, that feel? Amazing. I mean, Mariah Carey is someone that I've always idolised and, you know, along with the Whitney Houstons yeah. and, um, you know, I've always been, you know, wanting to be seen for as a vocalist. Mm. And it's so good whenever people recognise that. Now, over here, I mean, you... you People have, have just got to know you now overnight, but you've actually been in the entertainment business for quite a while, haven't you? Yeah, I mean, um, I've had a, I've had a history basically yeah. of, of working in business. Um, you know, I would perform locally all over my, my hometown, singing the national anthems for all the sporting events and stuff, and and got known as sort of the little girl with the big voice at age like you know around yeah. my hometown at age like around ten or nine or ten. And I'm still pretty small, <laughs> still to this day. Yeah, I can still go by that name. But um, you know, um, and then I had a history on MMC, the Mickey mm -hmm. Mouse Club. Yeah. Back home with um, fellow Musketeers, the NSYNC guys, and Britney Spears. Yes. It was a lot of fun. Oh, that's good. Mm -hmm. So, do you, do you get to see Britney much anymore? Because you're both highly um, successful now. I, I do get to see Britney, but it's only like around like award shows and things like that. Just whenever our, our schedules happen yeah. to just coincidentally, you know, collide. Yeah. So, and it's always nice to see her. She's sweet. I mean, we, you know, we were friends on the Mickey Mouse Club, so it's always good to see her. Now, you're going to be performing uh, your new single for us a little bit later on, yeah. Genie in a Bottle. Yeah. It, it's, um, it went straight in at number one in the States. Yeah. It, was that it was a shock crazy. For you? Yeah. I mean, like, you could only hope to be, you know, debuting you know I'm, I'm like a nobody basically and it was my first album and, mm. and the week that I came out I was up against a lot of other people that you know I w that were already established and well known mm. and successful and it, just, it was a dream come true to Did be number one for five consecutive weeks I couldn't believe wow. it couldn't believe Did you have it. a big celebration when you found out yeah well between you know whenever I got time off finally <laughs> <laughs> you know uh, I know right um, but my a &R guy he actually threw me a, a big party it was really really sweet Brilliant. it was fun and there's a good chance you could be shooting straight in to number one here in Britain as well. Oh, We're going to find out. Crossed. We'll find out a little bit later, <laughs> later on in the show how we're going. But um, I do hear as well a little birdie's told me about you have a, a bit of a crush on Mr. Robbie Williams. <laughs> Is this how true? How did you know about that crush? Ah, got my contacts. <laughs> I know. Is right? that true? Um, I'm, I've always thought he was a bit cute, you yeah. know what I mean? But it's more the way a guy acts, you right. know? It's a confidence that always attracts everybody yeah. to, you know, people. Um, and, um, you know, he just seems to have a, an overload of confidence. <laughs> yes, I think that's one word you can use about Robbie. He has but got it's a little a bit, bit cute. of cute. Have you met him? What is I've he like? Met, I've never met he's him. A really, he's a nice guy. Is he? He's very confident. Yeah. <laughs> very confident, <laughs> indeed. Um, yeah, indeed. So, um, he's over there at the minute, isn't he? Over in the States, and he's trying to crack America as well. So I, you think kind so. Of I think so, I think so. Missed each other. What's the vibe on him over there in the States? Um, it's a good vibe. It's Is a good it? vibe. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, I, I know a lot of people loved his uh, Millennium song or whatever, yeah. so um, he's doing good. Good stuff. All right, then, well, you've got some stuff to give away for us as well today, haven't you? I do. You've got a bit of a bit of a fleece here, which we're going to be giving away, <laughs> which is very nice. And we've got a, a CD as well, a single, and some uh, some pictures, and you're going to sign them for us. Absolutely. We've got them. Uh, thanks for coming in. We're going to be hearing from you a little bit later. Christina Aguilera, everybody. Yeah!